Howdy folks, greetings from the workshop. I've got a cool video for you guys today. You know, the folks over at CB Giddy, they, they make a lot of uh, cigar box guitar kits and other similar things like that, parts. And uh, they sent me this, and uh, hopefully you can read that. It says Hubcap Howler, and if you can see the picture there, it's uh, kind of like a combination of their Mountain Tenor guitar, and uh, they added, or basically like one of those that they added their... Um, resonator cone too so it's kind of like a tenor dobro kind of a thing new kit that they they came out with and they actually sent me a prototype or one of the first ones to build and to share with you guys so i'm super excited about it i got the kit unboxed at all the parts now construction wise it looks very similar to their mountain tenor which you remember i built one of those a while back and uh what I did with this one is I stained it with a lot of, uh, with light stain all over the back and such. And then I painted the top this burnt orange color and put a humbucker in it there, one of the delta buckers, and then put the little leaf uh, d design on the, on the headstock. And, and I really like that thing. And so I was really happy when they sent me this. And, uh, oh, well, you know what? Why don't I just show it to you? It's right here. Ha <laughs> ha. All right. So I've been building this thing over the past couple days. And you can see I kind of continued the same kind of idea I did with the mountain tenor, but I used a dark stain on this one. So I stained all the back and the neck and all of that with a nice dark stain. And then uh, I did red on the top here. And uh, then instead of doing a delta bucker like I did in the mountain tenor, I used one of the giddy buckers right there. You can see it. And of course you can see the jack down there in the corner. Uh, and so I just actually glued it to the surface there. It's just surface mounted with some glue. And uh, this one, the mountain tenor here, I keep tuned in the ADGB tuning, um, which I don't know if that has a name. We've, we've toyed with calling it the Texas tuning, but I, I don't want to claim it because I'm sure someone else has done that before me. But uh, so that's the AD, ADGB tuning. And this one I'm gonna tune in Chicago tuning, which is DGBE. Um, now you notice there are four strings on there and uh, this kit actually comes with bronze strings. So I replaced them with some uh, nickel electric strings so that the giddy bucker would, would do a good job of picking it up. And um, I used basically the high four strings off of a standard six string guitar pack instead of 11s. Um, and so that's what's on it now. Now I don't have it up to pitch yet, so you don't get the tune or you don't get any sort of actual uh, play, playability just yet. And that's because um, the glue here on this neck joint has been drying for about two hours. Um, and I just want to give it a little longer before I put tension on it. I'll probably let it go overnight before I put tension on it. But I did want to share it with you guys just to show you everything. You can see I put a star there on the headstock. You can see the, uh, the tuners there all the way down those cool F holes, the uh, giddy bucker that I added, and then the, the jack down there. Um, around the back, we've got that sort of arrangement with the three screw bridge. Uh, really nice. You can see how they did the bridge on this one, which is kind of different. I haven't seen that before. It's just kind of a, a floating piece there on top of the, uh, here, let me let you see it this way. There we go, that's a better way to see it. You see, it just kind of floats in the middle of the resonator cone there. And I notched the bridge uh, so the four strings would just kind of slide in there just a little bit. And I was worried that, that the um, giddy bucker might not uh, have the output to uh, pick those up, but I, I did test it and uh, it is able to pick up the strings. Of course, they're not in tune yet, so I'm not going to play any tunes just yet. There is the new Hubcap Howler kit from CB Giddy. I'm very, very thankful that they sent me this. I was super cool of them to send me this and let me uh, share it with all of you guys. I'm honored that they thought of me. And um, here she is. So these are going to be available at CB Giddy. I don't know the price or anything like that yet, but uh, these are coming. So very cool. And um, if you, again, look at it next to this one, you can see a lot of similarities. They are pretty much the same kit 
just with uh, just with um, uh, the resonator added. So uh, in the meantime, if you like what I do on this channel, why don't you go ahead and hit that subscribe button below. I will see you guys in the next video.